fried rice. Oh no. Good morning or good afternoon. So we are gonna go have this place called Ancient Beef Thai Cuisine. And it looks really bomb from the Google reviews. It's like right next to the hotel. Um, and they do like all kinds of beef over rice and fried rice. So just all kinds of beef dishes. Whoa, so we got the braised beef rice. This is the beef fat fried rice, which is I think one of their signatures with fried garlic. Best meal in Chiang Mai so far is this place, for sure. Culture. Best food I've had in Chiang Mai so far. Oh, Chinese New Year! So we're now gonna go to like a little bit more of an artsy district. I don't say artsy, but like maybe a little bit hipster. Um, there's a cool vintage store my friend wanted me to check out, and there's also some cool cafes around the area. Vanilla frap with almond milk. So we're now gonna go try to cut my boyfriend's hair because he needs a haircut and then he forgot to do, get a haircut in Shanghai. <laughs> so yeah, it's like a weird experience, but fun, I guess. So we're gonna go have dessert first. Coconut ice cream shop. Thank you. Wow. Oh, I treat Kobe. Wow. Aloy ma. So there's like salted mango ice cream with coconut ice cream, and then there's sticky rice and mangoes at the bottom. So we stumbled upon this place after um, Northgate yesterday, but it was like closed later on. But it was really good ice cream. Thank you. Okay, so we just had ice cream and then we got out of the hotel really late. So in Chiang Mai, most things are closed at like 9 or 10 p.m. So we're gonna try like a buffet that's not too far away and it's um, open until 2 a.m. So it's like a Thai style all you can eat buffet for only like over 200 baht. Whoa, buffet time. Got some fries. Whoa. The veggies. There's the meat. And we got the beef. Some rice, please. The rice is like kind of sweet. So 
over here. This one. Okay, so we're at um, Khao Soi Mai Sai, which is like very popular with locals and also with tourists. Um, we're gonna wait a bit for the Khao Soi. We've been having a lot of Khao Soi so far in Chiang Mai and in Chiang Rai, but I feel like so far I haven't had Khao Soi that was like really, really good. Like it was good, but it wasn't very like wow factor. So let's see if Khao Soi Mai Sai is the one. Chicken, that's the beef. Now a little bit of lime. I love this crunch. <laughs> <laughs> Dip it in the sauce. Mm. This is very tender. It's like a very strong flavor. So I think this cow soy is like much more flavorful, um, richer. And then I love how the noodles are actually chewy. I don't like soft noodles. Extra crunch. Dragon. It's like very creamy and smooth. This one, it's like a chocolate store and factory. Whoa. So they have like all these selections and it's like fair trade. Um, and they produce all the all the chocolates and the co uh, cacao locally. They got the cow soy curry, coconut curry chocolate, peanut curry chocolate. I'm gonna try the cow soy curry. It actually tastes really good. It's like salt, it's not like salted chocolate. A little bit of curry taste. Yeah, I actually like this more than like the normal chocolates, surprisingly. Very rich chocolatey flavor. Oh, not too sweet. Whoa! Okay, so we got this mashed eggplant with egg, and then this is the red curry with. Northern Tide herbs with chicken. And then this is like a local veggie with egg stir fry. And then of course this is caprao, less spicy so you don't see too much chilies. Mm. Look at all of that, I don't know what this is called in English, but it's like apparently like a local veggie. It's called Xiang Da. Xiang Da. Let's try the mashed eggplant because apparently you can't adjust the spiciness, so it's not like too spicy. Oh my god, it's really spicy. That's really good. How la? They mash up, they probably mash up the chili already. If you can eat spice, I would definitely recommend this dish. Good morning. So today's gonna be the last day um, in Chiang Mai and we're gonna go to the Jingjai Market. So it's like a morning market. Um, and on the weekends they have like 
kind of like farmer's market. They have like uh, arts and crafts shops and then they also have like little food stalls. Oh, it's chicken skin. Yeah. Gotta get the chicken skin and the sweet and sour sauce and then like a bite of sticky rice. Yeah. Try this. Oh. Wow, it's too good. 